What is up, YouTube? It's your boy, Big Blue Bug, back with another episode of oh, oh, Sunny Side. <laughs> Happy to be back, as always, with more Sunny Side. Love me some Sunny Side. Uh, I chopped this down last night. Ignore me. Uh, let me just finish that up. Oh, okay, there we go. Uh, I thought I had more hardwood, but I'm starting to realize I have so much softwood right now and not a lot of hardwood. Who is that? Hey, Gabe said you need my help. Oh, goodness. Okay, okay. Oh, she's going to teach me to freaking cook. Uh, who is this? <clears throat> oh, sorry. It's Hina. I own Naka, the restaurant by the lake. Oh, hi. Gabe did give you my number? Hi, did Gabe give you my number? He did. Sorry. It's okay, I guess. He said you wanted cooking lessons. Oh, yeah, that would be great. Good. Uh, come by Naka. I'll give you a free lesson. Really? Yep. Awesome. Are you going to give me hours? Uh, wasn't she going to give me hours or something? All right, I guess we're just going by Nakas. I don't know. I also have all that wood on me, so. And I have a screenshot of what I need for that thing I'm building back there. So let's ride to town. I guess I'll pop over to Nakas. Uh, I also don't have a lot of money, but I imagine I'll probably eat there. I hope. Man, bike's awesome. <laughs> the bike is awesome. Okay, let me, uh, you might be like, no, where are you going? I'm going down to, uh, actually, I should pop into both these places. I'm not going to have money to do this, actually, am I? I don't think I'm going to have money to do either of the things I want to do. Ooh, that was weird. I guess I can just go say hi to him. Howdy do. Hmm. Is everything all right? I can't decide if it's going to rain or not. And I wanted to take Shiro on a walk through the gardens tonight. Um, what time does your shop open, sir? I should have checked that before I came. Tell me it's nine. I flip out. Saturday, it's closed. Oh, that's even worse than being open at nine. What about the other place? Sunday, it's closed. Saturday, it's open. Get out of the way. We'll go do something with our wood. Oh. I'm, I'm lining myself up for this. I'm sorry, guys. Wow, man. I don't know how many times I can say it. I'm sorry. I'm going to stop saying it now. It's just this is awesome. This has actually changed. There was a minute there where the game was getting a little bit like, oh, I don't like the glitching and I don't like it stuttering and stuff but right now no stuttering I can cruise the bikes a good addition I feel like it uh got back into a pace where I'm like this game's here to stay I don't care uh, I believe the entrance is right over here this place I thought it opens at nine doesn't it nine uh, I got a little time to burn. Can I chop down a... This dude's like, dude! <laughs> that's my tree! This tree doesn't look like it belongs to anyone. Maybe I can only chop down and manage trees on my lot. I guess that would make sense, but come on. What's this store? Oh, it looks like an actual farm. Seven. Oh, let's pop in here. I got, uh, I got, I got thirty minutes to burn. Put away the axe, man. Put away the axe. The mill shop. Xander, what can I do for you? Uh, purchase items and services. What do we got? Wheat, flour, molasses, berries, jam, straw. I don't think I need any of this. Unless you have rice. 
I'm going to try and buy some short grain rice and see if maybe I can use my cooker for it. Thank you. Will you buy anything I have on me? You want grass? You don't want grass. You don't want sticks, do you? No. Wood? No. No. Bam mm, no. Okay. Who's this guy? Hi, Yuma. Hey, you must be the new farmer in town. I am. Great. Name's Yuma. I own the mill down by the lake. Oh, that's nice. We sell all kinds of products. May we sell all kinds of milled products. Grains, sugars, even tea. Uh, you be sure to come by and get anything you want, okay? And if you need anything, don't hesitate to ask. Everyone in town is pretty friendly, even if it takes a few to a few of them sometimes to war warm up to you. It's good to know. Thanks, Yuma. Anytime. I'll see you around. Cool. It's nice to meet you, Yuma. Uh, where did I park my bike? Wait. Did I leave it on the road? Oh, I left it at the other place. Okay. Whoo. I got worried. Okay, I got the list of what we need in my pocket on my phone. So, if you guys like, where's he getting this list from? Just know I have it on my phone. Uh, purchase goods and services. Um, what? No. Oh, services. Okay. I was like, no, I need... Oh, you can make panels with just softwood. Oh, okay. Well, how many of these do I need? I need... One moment. I got on my phone. I need four panels. Oh, boy. This is going to be expensive. One sec. How many softwood planks? 20 planks. Well, we have the softwood for all that, and the total's just coming to $80. I haven't, I could just do this today. And what about hardwood? How much is hardwood? Let's say I need a hardwood. I need, I need quite a few beams. Okay, beams take 10 hardwood. And what do I need? Like four, eight beams. Okay. So what we're going to do is one, go to the shop. Uh, I'm going to go ahead. It is nice. They'll sell me blueprints. Uh, I actually want to sell you some stuff. I need, I'm going to sell you some of my, I guess just the flex. Can you just buy all of it? 26 bucks. That ain't bad. I can give you the sticks too. Six cents a stick? Okay, that's not great. How much for the hardwood? I'm gonna sell them all the hardwood. You might be like, no, that's crazy. I know it's crazy. Services, okay. We're gonna do what I was doing for these. And I need 20 of these planks. And I think that's all I needed that I can make right now. Clay tiles, not here. Glass, iron bolts, iron screws. I need none of that. I just need these. Okay, well, this is at least a good start purchase. I'm going to have to chop down a bunch more trees. Goodbye. Cool, that'll be here tomorrow. Okay, let's head over to uh, Nada's. Because I'm starving. I'm going to drop dead soon. Where is Nada's? Oh, it's right over here on the left. Cool. Dude, I you wouldn't want me cooking if I had this little bit of my stomach. I'd be... I'd be mad. I'd have an attitude. I would not be a... Uh, chipper. Is this it? Just want to make sure. I think I'm going into the person next door's garden. All right. One sec. I'm just going to leave the bike there, but I think I do go up over here. Hey now. Days like this, I actually am thankful for not being stuck at work. Let's go check it out. Oh, there she is again. Hey. Hi. Uh, ready to learn? Honestly, this is a little weird. Why? Well, I don't really know you. <laughs> Welcome to small town life. Anyways, 
Wash your hands. Meet me in the back. Okay. I don't... Uh, all right, the basics. There are a lot of different appliances in the kitchen. Some uh, help with prep work. Others do actual cooking for you. Prep appliances are things like cutting boards and a food processor, a stand mixer, or even a hot water kettle, really. But then cooking, that's done on a stove or in the oven. I guess we'll, uh, well, rice cooker cooks rice and the kettle technically cooks water, but you know what I mean. So I need a kettle because I'm not gonna be able to make rice. Uh, most things that cook that you cook, they're going to take different steps. You can't just toss flour and water and yeast in the oven and expect to get a pizza. You need to make the dough first and the sauce first, and then it comes together later. Does that make sense? I think so. Okay, let's start with some simple lemon pepper fish filet. That sounds scary. It can be, but that's why I'm here. First thing you need to do is break down the fish into filets on a cutting board. Sure, you could use just grill up a whole fish, but if it, but if you break it down into filets, you get four meals instead of just one. Oh, that was what he said, not what I said. But <laughs> once the fish is broken down, we can cook it in a pan on the stove with some lemon, pepper, and salt. You can throw in some herbs in there too, uh, if you're feeling fancy. That's it. Not so hard. Not on paper, but in reality, you have to pay close attention to the food. Leave it there too long and it's going to burn. And the better you get at it, the easier it's going to be. Uh, do you have the cook app, the cookbook app on your phone? If uh, cookbook app, yep. Uh, here, give it to me a while back to help track all my recipes. Here, I'll send it to you. Thank you. Wow, great, thanks. Uh, no problem. Tell you what, I'll send you a few more easy ones. Sticky rice. Uh, when you get better at cooking, come check in at Naka and maybe I'll give you some more. Alas, Gabe, also, Gabe said he, uh, cook, he took you to, uh, sac uh, in town. I assume he got you a rice cooker. Um, no, he got me a camping stove. Camping, the man, that man, seriously, sometimes he forgets he lives in Japan. Here, did you just give me a rice cooker? Didn't I just make a rice cooker? Here, I have a spear one. It's even outdoors friendly. Wow, this is, uh, thank you so much. No problem, food's important. If you need rice, you can buy it from Yuma at the mill next door. Uh, he mills all kinds of, yep. In fact, the tea we serve at Naka is processed by Yuma. <laughs> we serve coffee too. Yes, but uh, we don't get it from Yuma. If you recall, you still haven't found a reliable source yet. True, but it's still the best thing in Sunnyside. Fair. The community really seems to support each other. We have to. Small towns like this one are disappearing all over Japan, so we need to stick together. That goes for you too. Me? Sure. You're part of this now. Right. No pressure. Holy crap. That was a lot of reading. Okay, wait. She just told me how to cook. She didn't cook? Oh, man. One moment. I need to eat. Give me a small chai and I, a curry dish. Can you give me two curry dish? That's going to be, that's too much money. And maybe one of these guys. These guys are a little cheap. Toss two of them in there. there. Thank you. Wait, what services do you offer? Oh, recipes. Cheese slice. Grilled cheese, huh? Well, goodbye. Thank you. Did she give me a rice? What is this? This is a rice cooker. This one's a bamboo steamer. Oh, is a st I guess a steamer is probably different than a rice cooker, obviously. Uh, let me go find my... Oh, I still had a food left from yesterday. Well, I'll eat that one first. Boop, boop. All right, all right, all right. How do I get out of here? This place is a maze! Kyle, what are you doing up there? Hey there. Hello, I'm Kyle. Nice to meet you. Hi, I'm Noah. And just moved to Sunnyside? That's right. How do you like it so far? It's great. I'm glad. Oh, hey, if you ever need anything, don't hesitate to ask, okay? Like what? <laughs> well, I'm great at fixing things. 
or if you just need a friend to hang out with, I'm here. That's so kind of you. Thank you. Anytime. Imagine a town where everyone's young, nice people doesn't exist. It's such a young town. This would be so nice if it, this, this place actually existed. It doesn't. Every town has some angry old people in it. <laughs> angry young people too. Don't 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 get me wrong. <laughs> Actually, you know what? My neighbor's pretty crappy and not old. Not particularly old. She's probably, you know, early 30s and she's a jerk. Okay, let's head home and see if I can find some trees to chop. And I guess I can try out this, uh, this steamer. I have rice on me, so maybe it's uh, as easy as just boiling rice. I doubt it, and I probably need other things I don't have. The game's like, you can't make rice without salt and pepper. I'm like, dude, you can make some bland rice without salt and pepper. I'll tell you that right now. Wow! Okay, I want to try this rice cooker. Um, it is F drone. Is it just gonna have a? It does. Is it just gonna have a rice cooker? That was gonna be my joke. It does. Nice. Okay, let's try that. Is that it? Do I need, does it, do you actually need more than just rice for rice? I probably need water or something. Ah, crap. One moment. Let me check my cookbook. Cooked rice, two hours, water. I don't have a bucket on me, do I? I have no good way to carry water, huh? Alright, looks like cooking's for next episode. Time to start chopping down evergreens. <laughs> you know, cooking's for next episode. Deforesting time. That's what time we're at. Wow, this guy's taking a lot of swings. Oh, well... I guess I was probably... Softwood? Which one's hardwood? This one looks like a big tree. They make... But look at the trunk. It's a skinny trunk. Come on. Soft. <laughs> Maybe I shouldn't have sold the hardwood. I should have more food. Uh, let me have, let me, let me try my small chai. Uh. Yum. I don't know what's considered an evergreen. This guy's like. Or oh, what's considered hardwood? This one? This one's massive. Even the, the trunk has texture to it. I'm so lost. What's considered hardwood? This one? Maybe this one? This one's funny looking. It looks different than the rest, I guess. 
Dude, at least I guess I'll have money. So it's the funny looking ones. Like, this one's funny looking, but that one's not uh, big enough, I don't think. This one? I wonder if it just varies. I'm gonna hate if that's the how it is. Like, yeah, this one's gonna be okay. So the pink ones. Okay, never mind. I can I can work with that. I can work with that. I should look for bigger pink ones. Like, that one looks pretty nice. Can I get over there? I can't, can I? Oh, I can. Oh, crap. Don't care about the rain. The rain never bothered me anyways. Where's it from? Where's it from? Somebody give me the... Don't go in the water for the love. Almighty. Wrong, it's from Frozen. Okay. <laughs> Wait, that's totally not from Frozen. That rendition's from nowhere because it's the snow. <laughs> the cold never bothered me anyway, I think the actual saying. Okay, so I'm going to need like a lot of hardwood now that I think about it. Because what is it? It's f 10 per beam? I'm gonna need over a hundred hardwood. I forgot to water these. Is this ready to be picked yet? Oh my god, it is! We got potatoes! Let's go! I guess those probably don't need water since you know this. But it's all wet. I feel like I should expand my garden at some point. Oh, this one's a big pink one. Let's go. This guy should have enough wood for me. Just throw your whole back into it. You really should injure your back if you're chopping right. You should have some of the worst back pain ever seen if you're getting a good chop going. This one's not big enough. What about this one? I want to see something that's not freaking have red leaves. That's a... Uh, It's a hardwood. Because there's not enough trees with red leaves for me to just... This one was a hardwood. Let's go. Look at how big she is. Oh, man. Oh, that was softwood. Was the other part not... Maybe the other part was softwood, too. That's 71. I'm going to need at least a couple hundred. How many hundred? 200? I don't know how many hundreds I'm going to need. I guess tomorrow when I go to the farmer's market, we can start mapping it out. Like, that was 15 more hardwood. Here's a nice big pink one. Let's go for this guy. Dude, we have so much stamina. Dude, you drink a chai latte and have a little, little rice dish, a little curry dish. Changes your whole week around, baby. Nice, dude. I know. We're just spending a lot of time chopping trees. But I have the energy. I can't just go to bed with this type of energy. Are you crazy? Wasting this? Wasting this potential? And you guys heard me math it out. It's going to take so much of... Uh, so much hardwood to do it. I, I can't just let it go. 
Next episode, we got Farmer's Market. So you guys are in for a treat there, I imagine. And then after that, I think we'll probably go get a dog. Oh, we might be done with the house by then. I also need to figure out, uh, what's the word? Not, I need to figure out iron, uh, nails and glass, both of which I don't know where they come from. Whoop. You know, hardwoods grow in the water line. Proven fact. That ain't proven. That was a, just a lie. I actually feel like if you normally see a hardwood, it's probably not on a water line. It's probably the opposite. Okay, how much how much hardwood we at? Almost two hundred. Okay, I, I the problem is I don't know the numbers. It's eight hardwood beams. What was that? Twenty a piece. And then 10 hardwood planks. But a plank must just be, what, two a piece? I think if I got a few more, like maybe three more, I think we might be good. Let's go! For those of you that don't know, I'm playing in RPG mode, by the way. I... I don't know if I've said that. I feel like I haven't. I don't even think I showed it when I started the save. But yeah, it's RPG mode, so it's extra hard. Which might have been my mistake. We're probably so close, dude. Take a little bit more energy out. Let's go. And let me just get this one. Come on. Get me that extra kick. Let's go. Okay. That might be enough. I don't know. What's that? A little bit over 200. 208. Is that enough? I hope it is. I hope it is. I think it might be. I don't know. I'll math it out. I'll math it out before we go. Because if I, I'll probably just end up chopping down a few more trees tomorrow. L let me not lie to you guys. I'll end up just chopping down a few more trees to be safe. Oh, and there's one right here, actually. So let me just grab that now. Well, we got the energy, right? Let's go. I don't even remember what time I'm supposed to go to bed by. It must be like 11. Right? No way, it's 10. Just finish this tree. Nice, 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 nice. Okay, okay. Guys, thank you so much for watching. I appreciate your time and viewership. If you guys are enjoying the series, make sure you hit that like button. Make sure you subscribe so you don't miss any more of the spicy contact. Next episode, we're probably freaking cooking. Let's go. Okay, bye.